を例え何々でも。リグラマーを例え何々でも is mean that even if dot dot something is the case even if dot 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 something is the case so how to use in Japanese when you use the grammar of tatoi nani nani demo you can use the verb the noun and the adjective nice adjective and e adjective and you see here but when you use the verb, you should change the verb to be the de form. And after that, followed by mo, she means de mo. For example, you can say itte mo, right? Kite mo, tabete mo, something like this. And for the noun, when you use with the noun, you should uh, end by de mo, right? De mo. First of all, go hang de mo, tabe mo no de mo. Something like this. Ya sai de mo, right? And for the uh, na steep, you can do uh, the same just now. Which means that after na steep, you should end by or you should follow by de mo, right? Kile de mo, something like this. And for the last one is e steep. When you use with the EHD, that means you should cut out the E, right? And after they follow by KUTEMO, for example, OISHI KUTEMO, right? OISHI is mean E and by E, but you should cut the E so we can say OISHI KUTEMO, something like this. So this, uh, this, this means how to use the gamma of TATOI NANI NANI TEMO, right? And it has the meaning, the same meaning that even if dot dot something is the case, right? But it depends to the verb, right? To the noun and to the adjective, right? So the next, let's go to see some example together to make more understand about how to use the grammar of tatoi nani nani demo. The first example, tatoi kare wa. Isokashikutemokuruyo which means that even if he is busy, he will come. Even if he is busy, he will come. It is isn't time you see that uh, they use uh, the EHD from it is case. In here our HD is O Isokashi, right? Isokashi is mean busy. But in this case they cut out the E so we don't have E in here, so we just left only Isokashi. But after they follow by kute mo, right? So by follow with the gamma this is the correct one. So you can say Isokashi kutemo kuru yo. So in this can so in this sentence you can translate to be English like even if he is busy, right? He will come. Kuru yo which means he will come. The next example. Watashi wa oya ni tatoe hantai salite mo ryukakushitai des. Watashi wa Oya ni tatoe hantai sale demo ryukaku shitai desu. Which means that even if my parents are against it, I want to study abroad. Even if my parents are against it, I want to study abroad. It isn't time you see that uh, they use the verb. In here, our verb is han tai suru, right? Han tai suru, han tai sareru, right? Han tai sareru. What we change to be the mass form, we can say han tai sare mas. Han tai sare mas, but we cut out the mas, so we just let only han tai sare and flow by demo, so we can say han tai sare demo. Tatoi han tai sare demo, right? 
反対する against。そう。反対されても留学したいです。はい、私は親にたとえ反対されても留学したいです。しみ。Even if my parents are against it, I want to study abroad. 留学したいです。しみ。I want to study abroad. It doesn't really mean that、uh, you have your opinion, your opinion or your idea. You thinking that you want to study abroad, but even, for example, your parents disagree with your opinion. Right? Even your parents disagree with you, but you still want to study abroad. So you can say the same thing like this to explain the feeling that what you mean and what is the problem happen. 私は親にたとえ反対されても入学したいです。レネシアンポ、たとえ元気じゃなくても、家族への手紙には元気だと書きます。たとえ元気じゃなくても、家族への手紙には元気だと書きます。ウィシミンダー Even if I'm not well, I will write that I'm well in a letter to my family. Even if I am not well, I will write that I am well in a letter to my family. In this case, you will see that、uh, they use、uh, Genki. Genki is mean the noun, right? So, When you choose it, now you can say, じゃなく、じゃなくても、ではなくても、right? You can say, で、元気、ではなくて、ではない、right? ではない、but, 元気じゃない、元気ではない、you have the same meaning. So, when you,、uh, 元気じゃない is mean that,、uh, is end by e, right? So, we change similar to the,、uh, hd, ehd form. So, in this case, you cut out the E and end by くてもそ、we can say, 元気じゃなくてもたとえ元気じゃなくてもし even if I'm not well. 元気 is mean well or strength or healthy. But 元気じゃない which mean、uh, Not well, not strong, not healthy. So, 元気じゃなくても is mean even if I'm not well. たとえ元気じゃなくても、right? 家族への手紙には元気だと書きます。Even if I'm not well, or even if I'm not healthy,、right? or even if I'm not feel so good, or even if I have Problem about my health, right? I will write that I am well or I'm healthy in a letter to my family, something like this. The next example, たとえ仕事がつまらなくてもあまり文句を言わない方がいい。たとえ仕事がつまらなくてもあまり文句を言わない方がいい。which means that even if your job is boring, you shouldn't complain about it too much. even if your job is boring, you shouldn't complain about it too much. it isn't that you see that、uh, they use the、uh, EHD, right? In here, our EHD is mean つまらない。つまらない。So, when we, in, we,、uh, we cut the E, so we just left only つまらな。And followed by くても。So we can say つまらなくても。Right? つまらない is mean boring. Right? つまらなくても is mean even boring. Something like this. So, in this example, they say たとえ仕事がつまらなくても、しみ
even your job or even your work is boring. Amalimonku or even Naihoga, you shouldn't complain about it too much. Something like this. So I hope that you understand about how to use the grammar of Tatoi Nanani Kutemo. Thank you very much for watching my video clip and I hope to see you about learning Japanese grammar in the next video clip. If you haven't subscribed my channel, please can subscribe my channel. Arigatou gozaimashita.